Yeah, I didn't know that, so I basically... Hello, Destiny fans! Wildchild well, here, welcome to another episode of uh, the Destiny walkthrough. And yet, there's no live commentary on this one. And uh, let me tell you, I decided to, in a way, challenge myself. Although, it's not like a super challenge challenge. But it's something fun to do in the game. And, uh, you know, it was using handgun only. That's, that's what it is. I do like doing pistol only gameplays. I think it's pretty fun. Yeah. And in Destiny, we got some pretty good ones here. But the problem is, I I don't know. I kind of like neglect them to, to use them because I thought I thought it was like you know not enough ammo on the clip, and uh, I was like, eh, I don't feel like using it. But uh, you know, I was kind of bored. And I'm like, I'm gonna go pistol only, and I'm gonna go pistol only or handgun, which is pretty pretty much the same. Um, even on a strike mission. Right, I know, I know. Next gameplay, we're gonna have a strike mission here in Venus, uh, and I'm gonna be using this pistol. So this was was my like um, yep, maybe oh, warm. I don't, I don't want to say warm up, but you know, trying to get used to it. You know how how I'm gonna, how would I do things? How I'm gonna you know kind of like upgrade because you have to upgrade your gun, right? So the first thing you need to do is kind of get used to that you only have six rounds on, on your clip because yes we do love the LMGs with like 70 you know 70 rounds you can just hold the trigger down and, and just go nuts same thing with the uh, a lot of the assault rifles which is pretty good but when you use a handgun you only have like six so you need to keep in mind you know and, and make those six bullets to count before you reload right we wish we had more we wish we had more uh, stand the clip, <laughs> but there's no. So you need to make those six bullets count before you reload. Otherwise, you're gonna get you know swarmed by enemy and it's gonna be crazy. So the thing is, pistols are pretty badass in this in this gameplay. They're really powerful, so you are not going to be in disadvantage. Um, like they're pretty good high in damage and, and and all that. So from that aspect, you're not gonna be in disadvantage. But once again, you're not only gonna have six before you have to reload. And uh, if you play this game, which I'm pretty sure you have, you know there's a lot of a lot of enemies all over the place. And sometimes, uh, even you know when you use assault rifles, it's not in, in, enough a clip to kill a couple of guys. Well, not a couple, of, you know, a bunch of guys. And, and, and you know how crazy you know the, the gaming can get. So the idea is that you need to do some uh, side missions first. Well, this is what I recommend. You do some, or a lot, or a, the, you know, whatever you want. Side missions first. You need to rank up your character. You need to get you know good gear. So let's say you're gonna tackle um, a mission that requires you to be level 12, for example. So you want to be level 18, right? So do do a bunch of uh, side missions, you know, with the with the bounty hunter, where the name is, you go over there, and you do everything to get all the all the extra XP and everything. And um, you know, after you've done a bunch of side missions and and extra stuff, you're gonna find yourself like level 18 with no time. So by the time you're gonna tackle that level 12 missions, you know, when you play in the story. Uh, it is going to be so much easier because your armor is going to be really great. You're going to have good guns. You're going to have uh, well, you have a, a nice handgun uh, with uh, you know really good damage. Also uh, upgrades. So that that's the thing. You need to kill a lot of these guys, the uh, you know the enemy, in order to get some upgrades for your gun. In in this handgun, I forgot which one is is this one. As soon as I find out, I'll put a. Uh, Little annotation on the screen if you wanna use this one. Keep an eye for for uh, for the hang of this one. It reminds me a bit of um like a 44 Magnum. I don't know how's that look, right? But anyways, so what you want is is some upgrades. In, in this case, I have an upgrade for this one that um I think is more damage when you shoot from the hip. So that's pretty badass. That's pretty good. You know, you want that. You know, you want that mobility, and and, and all that. So it's pretty good. So you need to keep that in mind. Although it's not so, it's not so difficult if you don't do it, but it helps a lot. It helps. It helps a lot if you're planning on doing uh, handgun only. So remember, you know, try to rank up as much as you can. Side missions over and over and over, and stuff with the uh, with the bounty guy, and get that XP. 
crazy and uh, you'll be all set you know you don't have to worry about it because I know some people who are not used to people don't like it and sometimes they just think about you know challenge themselves just like I do it's like yeah you know I'm always using assault rifles let's try one of these handguns you know let's try one of these handguns in, in you know with the big bosses you know how's that so you need to you know be at a higher you know level so let's say you have to tackle a mission that requires you to be level 14 so you better be level 18 19 or, or even 20 you know before you tackle that so you don't have to worry about well you do have to worry a little bit but you have more armor you know you have good armor and everything is good so give it a try next time you play this game and you'll see what I'm talking about it's pretty good the you're not gonna be in disadvantage but the advantage of these pistols is that you are like like one bullet or two bullets you know to to kill a guy you need you are like a like a one bullet guy you know what I mean it's so nice it's like a sniper rifle it's just a one bullet one kill so you're gonna be that guy you are going to be a nasty guy and uh, it's pretty good but it takes you know a bit used to it not having that much rounds on you you know only six before you have to reload so you need to keep that in mind and uh, it's pretty good over here I, I was failing so much trying to get that chest for some reason like that rock I don't know I think it was a slippery or whatever and I couldn't get it so <laughs> uh, a bit of a uh, pain in the butt trying to get that um, gold chest and now uh, when I play all these missions I do if you watch my gameplays I do uh, explore a little bit but I don't explore too much that's because I'm doing you know the mission you know when I'm doing the mission that's what I let you focus on yes I do look in you know corners maybe a little uh, little dark rooms here and there but I don't go too crazy once I'm done with the planet or you know and uh, I just go on on patrol mode and just go you know crazy and start looking for for things and uh, you know it takes a lot of time I don't post that but it takes a lot of time and, and you go from from you know corner to corner in, in, in the map trying to look for, for for the good stuff right so in the process you know you encounter a lot of bad guys and and that's a good time for you to try to rank up your gun and and also your, your character you know by doing the, the patrolling the extra missions and when you tackle the real missions when you tackle you know the strike missions for example uh, you're gonna be more powerful if you're planning to do pistol only although you can do the same thing with assault rifles but it is a lot or a bit easier you know you got more rounds and you got you know a bunch of good stuff so but uh, but once again I don't think the handguns uh, will make you less powerful maybe more powerful in a way you know it makes you more powerful but at the cost or not having that much that much of uh, rounds on, on each clip you know on each so it's it's you know it's a it's, it's a good balance there but it's pretty good and um, you know it's, it's a bit tricky sometimes when you get into this part of the, the, the you know the, the game where it's like a tons of enemies tons of enemies and they just come from every single direction and all you have is a pistol so it's like kinda crazy but uh, you know it, it can be done it can be done and some of my newer gameplays you'll see me using um, the handgun some of the newer gameplays because I think it's pretty good and uh, I want to keep on liking more you know really powerful ones and uh, hopefully maybe I don't know so, some upgrades as well so once again I want to challenge you see if you can uh, see if you can do it I'm pretty, I'm pretty sure you can other people do but um, I don't know if, if I want to put in a percent from um, from what I've seen so far in the game, not many people use the handguns. I would say maybe maybe 15, 20 percent from what I've seen. A lot of people, and I do like uh, sniper rifles. I like it. Uh, you know, I like the assault rifles. The LMG is a pretty beast. But uh, you, you you don't see much of people using the, the handguns, and and that's because of that. You know, you only get four maybe six bullets, six rounds so it's a bit tricky sometimes when you get into this crazy into crazy, you know, fights in, in the game so but I'm gonna keep doing it because I like the challenge and I like the handguns and uh, you know, I like the whole thing so uh, you can look forward to that and uh, like I said, even the, even the strike missions and the next one, next gameplay we're gonna have a, like a good one good one, it will be pistol only that's it, pistol only. And the funny thing is, you never run out of ammo. Like you get 
uh, with this one I think I get like 60, 60 around in total. Um, uh, yeah, 60 total and like 6 in the chamber. And uh, the chamber, whatever it is in this gun. And I never run out of ammo, you know, it's, it's, it's pretty good. So it's, it's not bad, it's not bad. You know, where you are doing main mission or side missions or whatever, you know, you, you, you're you safe, you're good to go, and you're also powerful, so what's not to like, you know, I like having that kind of power in my hands, I think it's pretty good, so, it is good, and um, very soon, we're gonna get into a nice uh, little boss fight here, and I'm gonna stick to, to the pistol, I'm gonna stick to this handgun, because that's that's the challenge and uh, I like it and you'll see that it's not so I think it's I think maybe you are you're in advantage in, in a way because if you can aim if you have a decent aim and you can aim to the enemy's head it's like one bullet one kill and that's it you know that's it you don't need to use more so it is good it is very good so it's, it's a good way to challenge yourself it's a good way to have fun you know to get you know to get the kills and uh, I don't know, maybe you play a little bit different. We always used uh, all these guns when we play all the games, you know, like Halo, Battlefield, Call of Duty, you know, we always use the LMGs, SMGs, uh, assault rifles, you know, not so much with the pistol, so it's it's good to come to a game like this one and have some fun with the pistol, you know, it's a bit different, and, uh, you know, it's, it's pretty fun, what, what's not you like? So it's all good, but I'm trying to remember what is the name of this one? I I don't know if this is an MK. I don't think so. I, I'm not really sure. But uh, I like it. I like it a lot. It's it's this very deadly. Once again, you need that. You need to find the one that has an upgrade. Of, uh, the hip upgrade. That's what you want. That's I don't want to say the best one, but that's a plus. That's a plus having that. Uh, I think it's extra power or whatever it is when you fire from from the hip when you kill the enemy from the hip. So um, it's good, it's good, and I like it, and uh, I'm gonna keep doing it. So we're getting close to to get Tino into into this uh, boss fight over here. Um, you know, we, we got a, another guy over here in in, in our party team, actually friend of my uh, partner here. So uh, it's good. It was pretty fun. Uh, the live commentary was pretty fun. But uh, I don't know the, uh, the computer. I don't know, it's like stopped working or whatever. Whatever happened, so I lost it. I lost that one. So so sad, so sad. But you know what? It's it's all right. It's all right, and it's all good. And look, look, we can kill these purple eyes with no problem with this thing. Even at that range, and that's another thing. This these handguns, they have pretty good range. You can kill people from across the map. Even if they look really tiny, even with that, they don't move because they don't see you. But if you see them, you should like. Well, it's gonna take you a couple of more rounds, but you can kill them. It's pretty nasty. It is very good. So, um, I like this. The reload in this one is pretty, pretty good. Like I said, it reminds me like a like a Magnum for some reason. It's pretty, pretty badass. So we're getting close here to this um, to this boss fight. It's all good. My friends is uh, teabagging the enemy, which is good. Gotta, gotta make them pay, and um, yeah, we decided to to stick to it. So that's that's a trick. That's a trick, you know. Go to the boss fights with the pistol. I mean, because killing the the little uh, the little but the, the little guys with the flying sh uh, shanks and all that. That's pretty easy. That's not a challenge. But going to a boss fight with the pistol, that's where the challenge begins. That's when you're gonna see yourself like, whoa, this is nuts. But as you can see, no, no problem. Uh, fire from the hip because we got that advantage and uh, that's pretty good and look how this his health is gonna just go down really really quick always trying to aim for the head and uh, it's just pretty nasty you know those six rounds are just are just pretty beast so I like it you know have no fear <laughs> I have a hang on I have no fear you know I don't care if the guy is like twice my size I have no fear I'm gonna kill you with a pistol and make you look bad so it was pretty good but uh, yeah, that's it. A couple more rounds, and this dude is done. Look at that! Look at that! How cool is it? And uh, the funny thing is, at the end of this video, uh, I am going to be the king. <laughs> I am going to be the king because uh, <laughs> I just wait and see. Because I saw, I saw his uh, his little chair over here, and uh, <laughs> said it to sit on the on the chair. But anyways, thank you for watching. Hope you enjoyed this gameplay, this commentary. My name is Wild Child. And uh, I'll see you on the next uh, episode, live commentary. 
stay tuned and uh, don't forget to give it a try to the handguns because they're pretty badass and uh, pretty nasty. Alright, thank you for watching. Uh, later.